Hello friends and greetings for the day. Welcome back to another episode of Technical Vocabulary where we learn meaning and definition of several technical words. As a part of today's episode, we are talking about another document of testing called as test charter. Now what exactly test charter is and how it plays a vital role in the world of testing? When it comes to exploratory testing, which you can see in my other tutorial, you can find that exploratory does not deal with creating formal test cases. That means we do not draw a table to capture all the steps in detail, including the precondition, expected result, the test data, steps, and so on. Now, similar when it comes to ad hoc testing, which is quite similar to that, or you can say that it's just a synonym of exploratory testing, which is also known as random testing or monkey testing. Now in this testing, we generally do not prepare any test cases and we randomly interact with the system or a particular transaction or maybe a use case. As we do not have any formal documentation to do this job, logging this event could be difficult. That's where test charter comes into picture. A test charter is basically a log file which consists of all the details of this event that is exploratory test session which is performed by a tester. It basically includes the title of the session, that what exactly are you conducting, what are you going to achieve from this, so the objective of the exploratory session, the start date of it, and of course the end date would be the same, but start time and end time will be crucial here to be included as a part of the test charter. Also the title of the use case or the transaction or the module of the system which you are testing or exploring as a part of this session will be captured. Also the name of the tester, the environment and uh, the version of the system and many other things related to that will be also captured. At the end, a basic outline of what exactly was the observation of the tester during this entire interaction with the system will be captured here. And the same log can be submitted as a part of like timesheet which you utilized in order to do that. Plus, you will also define the duration of the exploratory test session which you actually utilized during the entire exploration. Because the duration can be limited between 30 minutes to 120 minutes of time for conducting an exploratory test session. So for more details, you can watch the exploratory testing video, which will help you more to understand that what exactly exploratory testing is all in detail. So keeping it short and simple, test charter is a log file, which is generally a documentation, lightweight documentation, which is used in exploratory testing to capture the event details. So that's all from this particular episode team. Should you have any other words with you, any terminologies which you want me to talk about, feel free to drop them comment below. I'm always there to assist you with all your queries and response them well. Till then, keep learning, keep exploring, keep understanding the context. Thanks for watching the video team and happy learning.